Hello, today we are going to make this manicure here. And in the process, we are going to test out this super sexy, super slim pencil stamper. And um, I'm going to show you a little trick to do with your Manny Defender. So I've started out with a coat of Shine Spark Polish Circinus Galaxy on my nails. And of course, I've got my Manny Defender uh, on in place to kind of protect my skin from what we're going to be doing here. So we're going to take Moira Stamping Plate 46, the Scrabble Plate, and we are going to stamp this heart image. And I'm going to stamp it first in black. And you're going to say, but you're not going to be able to see that. And you're right, you're not really going to be able to see it. And that's kind of going to be the point, and you're going to see why. And it's not absolutely perfect, but that's okay. And then I'm going to place it where I want it onto the nail. And you are probably not even going to be able to see that on there. Hey, see, you can barely see it, but that's okay because this is just a guide for what we're going to do. Because now what we're going to do is we're going to take your Manny Defender, your liquid latex. You're going to come in here and right where that heart is, as close as you can, you're going to fill that up with your latex. All right, and this is going to create a mask that's going to allow us to make sure that our second layer of stamping does not get in there. Okay, so I've got them all done and I've got everything applied and you want to make sure that they're completely dry. So I would even suggest making sure you're testing with your finger. Like this one's not completely dry, but it will be by the time I'm done the other ones. So next we are going to take more Moira Stamping Plate 59 Galactica, and we are going to use this image here. We're going to stamp with Moira SP08 Silver. We are just going to apply that right directly onto the nail so that we have all of it covered like that. And then we are going to very gently come in with tweezers or an orange stick or whatever works for you and we are just gonna pull up that little bit of masking that we no longer want and now and now what you have is you have all of the constellations in the background and then you have this little heart shaped hole in the middle so now what we're gonna do is we're gonna go and stamp that heart again and we're gonna stamp it in white so we can actually see it this time Okay, so now I have all of my hearts stamped again in white so you can see them. So now we're going to fill them in with this star font from Stamping Plate 46. Now it's not a clear stamper. It's pretty easy to see because it's so small where you're putting your L. So that got pretty good placement there exactly where I wanted to show inside the heart. And there's our little O. Little B. L O V E. And our little U. So I am going to top coat and clean up, and I'll be right back. There is the final Manny. Here is a still again for you. Um, I think this is a neat little tool. It gives you actually pretty precise application for something that's not a clear stamper. Um, this is, like I say, I'm doing this on camera, so if I were doing it off camera, I would be able to get it even a little bit better. And I love this technique to use the liquid latex as a mask to mask off different parts of your design. And here's how messy it looks if you do not mask off that part of your design. Um, so I will definitely be back with um, more manicures using this technique because I love it. Um, all right, thank you for watching. Bye-bye.